Hello everybody, welcome back to another video of Like Me Gaming. We are doing Across the Alps. This will be part number three. It's scenario number 11 of Railway Empire 2. So what we need to do this time is connect 18 cities to our rail network. We have 17, so we're close. We need to have 60 passengers without changing trains from Vienna to Marseille. And Vienna is in the Austria area we haven't gone into yet. Connect 1 million citizens to our rail network. We're at 500, so we're only halfway there. So all those um, warehouses and hooking up goods and stuff was a good idea because that will help us get to that probably. And then for our optional tasks, establish a connection from Venice to Greats that's shorter than 310 kilometers. So there's a good chance going to have to do a tunnel under the mountain for that. Then achieve an express status on a rail line between Zermatt and St. Moritz. I think that should be easy to do. And then establish connection between Zermatt to Turin that's shorter than 250 kilometers. Right now there's a connection that's 983, but I would assume we got to go through the mountains with the tunnel for that one too. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and let's put, let's let our time roll a bit here. Let's go from St. Moritz to Zermatt, which I, I think this should be doable. Let's put all our wagons on that let's go ahead and throw one down and we bought the Austria area and we're doing a line the gates here you have just connected the last mapped out city from the business plan of our backers and that even below the estimated time okay so that's our 18 cities to our rail network so that's good now we're gonna so we have our line down from uh, greats to Trieste so I'm gonna put three trains on that with their wagons and then I'm going to go ahead and put our gates to Vienna Express Line and we'll put three trains on that as well and see if that works to get us. So we've been working hard away at this tunnel and I think we have one that's going to be what we need. Just got to double check. I believe this should work. Our newest tunnel through the Simplon region Perfect. is completed. This is not only good for our trains, one lucrative offer is from the Compagnie Internationale de Vagondi. After the Orient Express unfortunately had to be discontinued during the Great War, it is now to run via our new tunnel. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to keep putting stuff on here. Let's see, I need to somehow put, I can put one there, I guess. And maybe put one here. Okay, and now let's put our train on. So Turin, so I built a separate station for it, just to make things easier. Let's go ahead and put three on there, and there we go. The line from Venice to Greats, I thought I was okay with, but it's actually seven kilometers too long, so we're gonna go ahead and just, ah, there we go. I just saw that a small mistake must have crept in. The line to Gretz was actually cancelled due to lack of feasibility, so you don't have to... What? Already completed? Uh, all right. Okay, so we got... There, we finished the line, put a, a thing there, so let's go ahead and delete this. This we don't need anymore. And let's double check and make sure we have enough. Okay, we should probably throw another one here somewhere. There we go. So they got a line for Trieste to Venice, Venice to Gates, Trieste to Gates, the Greats. I mean. We built out a station in Vienna, so it's gonna go to Greats. Put a three dragon, three dragons, yeah, three trains and th three wagons on that. We have our line set up from Vienna to Linz, and we got a three trains, three wagons on that to complete our outside ring here of transportation. We're gonna go from Linz to Salzburg with three trains and all our wagons and then we're going to go ahead and click Salzburg to Munich and do the same thing three trains all our wagons we now have a line from Greats to Salzburg we'll put our three trains and our wagons on that and now we have a train from Munich to St. Moritz with our three trains and our wagons now we have Zurich to Strasbourg with our three trains and wagons our little line between Zermatt and St. Moritz is more successful than expected our backers just told me that they want to remarket this success as the Glacier Express. And we have to continue growing our cities here in the south, so I noticed I'd forgotten sugar somehow. So we're going to bring Porcona 
in the turn with a load of sugar and then we're going to do the same thing and bring it into Milan with the load of sugar we're going to keep moving our way east so now we have a line into Trent of our sugar we're going to go ahead and put a line into Venice of sugar we'll maximize it there keep the mountain on it great boom then we're going to go ahead and start fishing in things to Trieste. We hadn't done that before, but just for fun, we're going to do it. Now we're going to bring in two loads of grain into Trieste because they do alcohol. We're going to bring corn into Trieste. Now we're going to bring in wood to Trieste. We're bringing the vegetables to Trieste from the south here, and we bought this fruit station. We're going to bring that in. They won't need it yet, but they will eventually. We're going to put a fruit train going to Milan. And then we're going to do one coming over to Venice. We don't want to go through the vegetable station though. That would not be good. There we go. And Mountain but Dijon has grown enough. We're going to put a sawmill down. Venice has grown. We're going to put a distillery down. Came up north here and we started a little warehouse. So we're going to bring in our wood. There's coal there, but it doesn't matter. We'll bring in that. We'll bring in three of them. There we go. And then we'll go ahead and bring in our grain. And we'll do the same thing, three of them. And then we're going to go ahead and put our train from the warehouse into grates. We'll put three trains on our two trains on that. And then we'll go ahead and put it into Vienna. Do the same thing. Eventually we're gonna go over to Linz as well. There we go. And here we are with our line to Linz freight. And then we're also gonna go Linz to Vienna. We'll put a train on that. And that way it can pass the alcohol and the meat back and forth. And then we'll also go Vienna to Grates. So we can do the same thing. Put a mountain on that. Perfect. We decided because we had the cloth down in Salzburg we're gonna throw a four city on here so we got our two trains going from the warehouse to there now we're bringing in two trains of cloth in the Vienna from Salzburg and we're gonna go ahead and click on the train station in Vienna here we're gonna put a warehouse and then we're gonna go ahead in the warehouse and let's see so alcohol is something we can say we already have meat We'll put cloth and then that'll divide it between the cities. We bought the corn here and we're bringing that into our Austria warehouse with our three trains. And also we bought this wool and we bought this cloth and we put a second station just to bring the wool in. So that should help. Now bring in our vegetables with our three trains in the Austria warehouse. And then we'll go ahead and bring in our milk from over here to Austria warehouse. Same thing, three trains. There we go. And then last but not least, we'll bring in our fruit to Austria Warehouse. Three trains. Just trying to keep the growth going. We see Milan has an industry spot open. We're going to put a sawmill in here. We're just working on growth. And so I noticed that Zurich is about to need salt. So I bought this salt. We're going to run it into Zurich. They don't need it yet, but they, they're close. Geneva does need it, so let's go ahead and run it into Geneva. Make sure I get the right train station. Perfect. Okay, we'll throw on a train. Oops, just one's fine. Make sure we send it fully loaded. Perfect. We're going to keep the salt going, and we're going to bring it into Nice. 
and then we're also going to throw another salt train and bring it into Marseille and there we go perfect now we're going to look at this okay we're going to have to upgrade this a bit Our network has spread to all corners of the mountains. A great success. It's a mad dash for growth. So we're going to go ahead and put a dairy down alliance. And that way the dairy can spread down to Marseille. And I'm thinking, okay, let's go to that. I'm pretty sure we do have worse. Yeah, I thought so. Let's go ahead and add dairy products to yeah. that. And we're starting another warehouse here in Germany. So we're gonna go ahead and put three trains of lumber coming in. Then we're gonna go ahead and put three trains of corn coming in. Then we'll do grain next. Three of those. Okay, and now we'll put our three trains of fruit. Actually, let's go to two trains of fruit should do it. We're going to bring in our two trains to Munich from the warehouse. And we'll go ahead and do the same thing to Alm. Bring in two trains from the warehouse from there. And now we have to add milk and vegetables. Now we have our vegetables coming into Germany warehouse. Three of them. Might not even need three, but... It may not hurt and then we'll put our milk and bring that in I think we'll just keep two of them and there we go we're gonna continue working on growth so we're gonna bring in a freight train for Nancy the Strasbourg Strasbourg should kick back uh, alcohol and cloth and then we're gonna go ahead and put a train from Strasbourg to Ulm Strasbourg is gonna bring so we don't want to bring the meat back from there and Strasbourg already has cloth. And there we go. We'll make that be a freight train. We'll put two of them. And that way we should move some stuff over there. Munich. And here we are hooking up our last warehouse. We're calling it France East. I should maybe Northeast would have made more sense. But anyways, we're gonna bring in three trains of grain. Then we're gonna go ahead and bring in three three trains of corn oh yeah I guess it's not gonna go anywhere if I don't put the warehouse in there yeah, eight perfect and then we will bring in our fruit this one will just leave a two Okay, and then we'll bring in our two trains of vegetables. Oh, once again, not going to do anything if I don't. All right, there's two. Then we'll bring in our three trains of milk. I put that there we go bring that in so I think the one thing left was wood I believe oh yeah I already have wood there okay let's go ahead and put our trains into our cities now so eight and then we'll put our wagon on then we'll go into Nancy Make it eight. Put on our wagons. Perfect. And I already did the trains between Strasbourg and Nancy, so we should be good to go. Oops, I realized I've forgotten the sugar. So we put a sugar line in here with three trains, and now we're good to go. We're just checking on Nice here. And we're going to go ahead and throw a paper mill in because it grew enough. So it's at 91. Marseille, still not enough.
Turin now has another slot, industry slot, so we're going to go ahead and put a clothing factory down to complement our cloth factory. You can't imagine how relieved I am to be able to check off this goal. Congratulations! Our Alpine rail network is a gigantic success. Our clients are extremely satisfied and have asked me to express their thanks to you. Oh, and by the way, I have to commend your conscientiousness. Not only did you meet our mandatory goals with outstanding thoroughness, you also went out of your way to meet every special wish our client had. Most impressive. All right, so let's see how we did here. So we did our 10 of 10 mandatory and our 3 of 3 optional. Got them done first, which is funny. So we got 300,000 points. Then we got 243,666. And then that gives us a total of 815,499. That's the most points we've had in every, in any scenario or even the first campaign. So I'm excited about that. So we were in Europe, 3.1 years, 405 million, 140 active train lines, 276 trains, 1,229 wagons, 33,000 kilometers in length, 86 train stations, 14 city buildings, 12 factories, 35 rural businesses, 21 connected cities, and 41 rural businesses. All right, let's look at the ranking. Drum roll, please. Find me, and we are 56. So 56 out of just under a thousand. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, really happy with that. I mean, you can always do better, of course, but if you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe. Come back and watch another great video of Like and Me Gaming.